Well, Northeast Minneapolis artists, galleries, and businesses are coming together for the 29th annual Art World. It's a big deal. It's happening this weekend at more than 100 different venues, including the Holland Arts Building. Our Shane Wells is introducing us to some of the featured artists this morning. One of the really cool things about Art of World is as you pop into all the different studios, you kind of never know what you're going to get. So we're in the Holland Arts Building, the West Building, and we have Abby Drock with us, and she's the designer for Cuvetta, an athletic brand. And as soon as I saw athletic brand, I thought, well, that's amazing. Tell us kind of how you landed here and got into what you do. Yeah, so I've wanted to start my own business for as long as I can remember, um, but as an endurance athlete, as a Nordic skier at Dartmouth College, I feel like there wasn't enough active wear that truly fit my strong legs and muscular lats. So therefore I set off on my own to create sports bras that leave room for strong muscles and backs um, and that don't chafe, and then shorts with a grip strip on the bottom so they don't Ooh. ride up while you run. Amazing. And then they're longer between the thighs so you don't chafe as well. So you said last year was your first Art of World and people will pop in and we're kind of like, clothing. Yeah, yeah, because there's a lot of, I mean, there's so many cool artists at Art of yeah. World and that's what makes it so great. But yeah, there's not a lot of small apparel designers in some of these buildings. Although weirdly down the hall is a dance costume yes. designer. So you two must collaborate a little bit here and there. You know, a lot of us see things in life where we go, I wish there was this, but then to actually do it, I mean, what was your, what did you major in? Um, I'm a, I was a psychology major, so... <laughs> how did you learn how to do this? Um, I have, I learned how to sew in high school. Okay. Um, but then kind of got into it more after college. And I'm a 2020 grad, so I graduated during COVID. <laughs> so... Had some time to figure things out. <laughs> yeah, so it was kind of like, why not give it a go? Sure. I love all the designs and color, too. That's one thing you don't see a lot in mm -hmm. activewear, I've noticed as well. Yeah. So I kind of wanted to do a design that um, stood out from a lot of the black and solid prints out there. So fun patterns, florals, um, I change them out frequently, so there's always something new. Um, and yeah, square neck design, which is also a little different. Than I think the square neck's really flattering. Yeah. And you're wearing one of your dresses, right? Yes, I am. So again, active dresses made for active bodies, so it flares out, it's not too tight, but it's still flattering and athletic. And with the floral pattern, you can wear it to dinner, but then also hiking. <laughs> I love that. A dinner and then a hike after, and you don't have to change your clothes. Yes. Perfect. Abby, thank you. This is quite amazing. I'm very impressed. <laughs> If you guys want to come check out Abby's studio, she is in the Holland Arts Building, the West Building. There's two on the campus. And Art of Will is happening Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And for people who want to just browse your designs, what's the best way to do that? Um, you can find us on Instagram, Cuvetta Athletic, or just cuvetta.com. All right, love it. And with that, we'll submit back to you guys.